Hi, this is Fat Mike with a new video about how to use your Ledger hardware wallet with VeChain. In this video, I will show you how to set up your Ledger with the VeChain Sync and Sync to Wallets, and also how to interact with VeChain dApps. This is not a guide about what a hardware wallet is or why you should buy one, but I really do recommend having a hardware wallet. In fact, if you want to buy one, I would really appreciate it if you would use my referral link down inside the description. So whenever you're ready, take your seat, watch and learn. Assuming you have successfully configured your ledger already, head over to the My Ledger page in Ledger Live and install the VeChain app. After installation, you should see the VeChain app on your Ledger screen. Open it, go to settings and enable contract data and multi-class. Open your Sync wallet on your desktop and make sure your Ledger is on application is ready. Head over to the right top of your wallet and click on the Ledger logo. Enter your device name and click on import. Well done, you have now created five VeChain addresses with your ledger. Sync2 works very similar. Open the menu on the left top of your wallet, click on the plus wallet icon, give your wallet a name, and click on the link now for Ledger users. Confirm by hitting the blue link button. By default, Sync2 only adds one address. To add more, hit the triple dots at the right top and click on new address. The addresses will be the exact same as your five generated Sync addresses and will be added in the exact same order. Time for some action. Use any modern web browser and navigate to apps.vchain.org. In this example, we navigate to Vexchange, where at the right top of the page, we click on connect to a wallet. Select Sync2 as your option, then open Sync2 at the top. Check the details and click on the blue continue button. Click on the selected wallet so you can pick another to sign the certificate with. I select my ledger generated wallet. Click on the blue sign button and follow the instructions on your ledger device. Now, verify the signing with your ledger. And voila, you have signed the certificate with your ledger hardware wallet. Well done. Signing certificates and transactions works the same on Sync, just with a different UI. For now, I wish you great times together with your Ledger hardware wallet in the VeChain ecosystem. You can find a link to the VeChain Dev Hub in the description. If you like this video, make sure you give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.